So over here, you can see that I have a shape right here on my fusion piece. And then if I want to go around and add in a jitter effect onto this particular shape, then all you need to do is from over here under the tools in shapes, you can see that S jitter that is shape jitter is an option. You can go around and bring this in right here and then you can connect it to the jitter as you can see right here. And then you can go around, give it an output right here. Once you do that, this is what you have, as you can see. So uh, this is uh, the, this is the shape that we have right here. And this is the jitter right here. Right now it's fixed, but you can go around and choose around the offset range right here for all of them. So here you can see you can work around with the Y axis. You can work around with the rotation right here, some jitter right here, some point jitter and so forth. Then if you were to change this into random, that one, what happens is that based on the range that you provided, you can press the play button and it jitters everything around right here. So let's say I don't want the shape to rotate much, then you can go around and decrease out the rotation. And you can see as I increase this, you can see everything in real time and how uh, like jittery this shape is. So that is how you can go around and add in the fusion shape jitter uh, option inside of DaVinci Resolve. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.